Audio Jungle. In a village next to a forest, there lived two woodcutters. They were neighbors, staying next to each other. Dina, the first woodcutter is a very energetic and honest one. Soma, the other woodcutter was a lazy and mean person. Both earned their living by cutting woods in the nearby forest. One day, as usual in the morning, Dina started his work. Hey, I started early in the morning. Bow ring. I will start a bit later. Soma led a miserable life as he was not ready to work hard. Dina went to the forest and looked out for woods. Here, I don't find any good wood. Let me go to the riverside where I will get wood. So, Dina walked towards the river. There he found a big tree. Dina climbed up the tree and started to chop the wood. As he was chopping, the axe slipped from his hand and fell into the river. Oh no! What have I done? That was my only property which earned money. Without that, what will I do? Oh God please help me! He started crying and prayed to God. God answered his prayer. God appeared and asked him, why are you crying my son? Mother, I dropped my axe in the river. Please help me. Don't worry. I will get you the axe. God took an axe from the river. It glittered as it was made of gold. Dina was stunned to see such a shining beautiful axe. But Dina said without any hesitation. No mother. That is not mine. God took again another axe from the river. It was made of silver. My son, is this your axe? No God. Now pulled an axe made of iron. Is this yours? Dina face showed the sign of joy. Yes mother. This axe is mine. My son. I am very much pleased with your honesty. Take all the three axes. This is a reward for your honesty. It's all yours. Dina happily went to his home with the three axes. When he crossed Soma's house, Soma saw the axes and was stunned. He went with the iron axe in the morning, but now he is returning back with golden and silver axe. Something has happened. Let me follow him and find out. Soma without the knowledge of Dina followed him. Dina reached the house and called his wife. My dear wife, where are you? Come on fast. I could not wait any long. I am coming. What's the matter? Come and see for yourself. Anything special. She came there and saw the axes. She was surprised. How? How come you got this gold and silver axe? Dina explained how the god appeared and gave him the axes. I find no words to speak. We will sell the golden axe in the market. Soma, who was hearing all this from outside decided to follow Dina the next day. The next day, Dina sold the golden axe and started a new happy life. Even though he has become rich, Dina went to work as usual. Dina where are you going at this early hour? As usual, to work. Okay see you. He is really a fool. Having become rich. Still he goes to work instead of enjoying his life. Oh. Let me follow him to find out where he chops his woods. Soma followed Dina to the forest. Dina went near the river and started his work. Ah this is the river where his axe slipped. Let me wait till he leaves this place. Soma waited till Dina left. Soma immediately went to the river. And deliberately dropped his axe into the river. Oh God please help me to get back my axe. God appeared. Why are you crying my son? Mother. My axe fell into the river. Please help me. 
This guy is playing with me. Let me teach him a lesson. God took out his iron axe first. Is this your axe? What Nina told his wife is that God showed the golden axe first. But now, she is showing my iron axe. No problem. Let me tell the answer. No God. Then took out silver axe and showed it to him. Is this your axe? No, no, not this one. God took out the golden axe. Is this your axe? Yes, yes, yes. This one is mine. God was furious now. How dare you? Telling lies to me. You should be punished for telling lies. Saying this, God disappeared with the axe. My axe, my axe, God please forgive me for telling lies. Please give back my iron axe. Oh God, what will I do now? All his shouting went useless. Soma returned home without the axe which was his only property. But he had learned his lesson. Moral, honesty is the best policy. The Honest Woodcutter